<laughs> hey Trot, is your dick a planet? Because your balls are in geosynchronous orbit. Wow. Yes. Yes. Trot, you've got a dick like a, a celestial body. Yeah. What? How? What do you mean how? How could dick be like that? It's bulbous. I don't know how it could be like that. It swelled in the middle. He got docked like a lamb's tail when he was born, but it didn't fall off. It just swelled. What? Welcome back to Trials. Welcome um, back. It's been a while. Um, has been. We've been on our journeys. We've been busy. We've been away. We're sun-kissed. We're s well, are you sun-kissed? Yeah. You know, we're sun-kissed, aren't you, Trot? Yeah. I do. I got a bit of a tan. Have you really? Yeah. Well, I haven't noticed it at all. Well, fucking hell. I'm sorry. Look, we can't all go around with a ghostly like Palaros. Well, I can, and I have to. I just burnt. For the greater good. <laughs> I just. Oh, hey, there's the sun. Burnt, peeled, back to white for I, you. I burnt my knee. <laughs> we went to Thailand um, last week. Um, just because we wanted to. Because no, there was fuck weird December. Reasons. Yeah, fucking hell. Didn't think I'd be catfishing in December, that's for yeah, sure. Yeah, we catfished a shit out of some catfish. Yeah, yeah. We sure showed them who's. I boss. still got the hook marks. Trop. All the fucking eye gouger. You see blinder they can't fish don't. <laughs> don't, don't. The blinder they don't call tell it. Tell them about the eye gouging. You didn't eye gouge. Don't gouger. talk for me, Ross. Well, right, go on then. Tell us about how you don't blinded. Don't talk about the blinding. You blinded a catfish. I didn't blind it. Its eye was fine after receiving a hook. Trot got this catfish out of the lake. You guys right? didn't see it. I did see You're it. Going on loose evidence. I fucking saw it. He got this catfish out of the lake and he said, "Come here." Come in, you bastard. Stuck his finger any deep in its eye socket and ripped out his eyeball. He said, I said, fuck your eye. The amount of slander I have to deal with on this fucking channel. Shot, did you, did, <clears throat> did you not blind a catfish? It may or may not have been in its eye socket. I don't think However, it, it might not have blinded it. Not the eye. It was in the eye. No, it wasn't. I saw the eye. It was, oh God. Oh, fuck. You didn't see the catfish beforehand. Well, true. But it did look as though it was slightly blind. Although most catfish do look like they have some form of impairment. Yeah. They are dumb looking fish. Yeah, they are pretty dumb. It's like um, evolution said, nah, I won't bother with I was sad the that they didn't have the whiskers though, the ones we we caught. Oh uh, yeah, but you saw one with whiskers. Yeah, yeah I did see one with whiskers. What um, with whiskers why yeah. don't they have whiskers? No no I, I'm thinking that they probably I don't know, if they Is it just the stress? Different um <laughs> stress of being dragged out of a river and off -breed. put back in. Yeah, it's a different breed of fish, I think. That's maybe really? they don't the bigger they are, the smaller the whiskers. The whiskers are used for feeling along the ground, so maybe these ones more like feed in the middle of the yeah. water. They're so incestuous in that lake. Ooh. They don't need them anymore. Yeah. They Crash don't. trot! It just turns out you just need giant rice balls on fishing lines oh, to eat. With like cherry scented flavour on them. Yeah. Yeah. That's, it was lovely. It Either was way. Lovely little trip. We filmed the whole thing. So that's going to be out sometime next year. That's it. Early next year. You'll enjoy it. Um, Before that, it's going to be the Chris Trot got a special yeah. massage, didn't you, Trot? Let's not talk about that. Trot got, uh, <laughs> so, so, Trot got molested. Let's past that one. <laughs> it slowly, slowly came out that Trot had received <laughs> a completely different kind of massage to what we got. <laughs> Why was more, that in a different room? More and more, there were just more details coming out. He's like, hey, <laughs> you guys didn't get the, the butt thing. It's when we were comparing, like, oh, do you remember when it, like, that she did that? It's like, no, that, that, that didn't happen. What? You were very <laughs> what do you mean it didn't happen? I, it happened to me. For yeah, example, that was an interesting Chinese meal discussion. Smith and Ross had panties. We had panties. They, well, don't call them panties. They, they, we had panties. They are panties. They're little panties. They're like, like little hair nets for your balls. They were. I was completely fucking naked. Uh, at your own choice. No, she said I asked her twice. Right. Do I have to take it all off? Yeah. And she said yes. And I said like everything. And she said yes, everything. I was I like, think, I feel like there was there was a lot of translation issues. Yeah. Well, because then you asked her what massage she was getting, and she just told you her name. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> My name is Leg. Okay. <laughs> Let's well, go. Did you ask again or not? I said, uh, yeah, what's the name of the massage? And I couldn't understand. She, she heard name, and she just said a name, I'm guessing. Yeah. Uh, and she understood name. That's one thing I was surprised at. The Thai's English, on the whole, was about as good as my Thai. I don't think... No. no I, think it was, I think it was better than that. My Thai's I, I, was, I was surprised. <laughs> Is it? So how well they spoke English for the, mo for the most part. Really? Well, in terms of like, I don't know. It's Considering that we whole We really country, struggle with taxi drivers. Yeah, the yes. whole country <laughs> is set up around tourism. Like, it's the most touristy Our hotel country was fine. I've been to in ages. Everyone in the hotel was fine. Yeah. And they really, it really like surprised me. Like, your concierge me. was very good. No, he still wasn't that good. I don't know. I think it's, uh, you know, I, I, think I thought they were quite good, considering. 
Considering like, what? The, considering the complexity of the differences in language. They are very fucking different. And you like, really have to invest in the tonality of it as well. Yeah. Like, I've noticed. Uh, it's not a nice language. <laughs> uh, well, it's more the fact that, like, I felt on the edge every time someone said hello to me. Right. I was just like, Swasti. Um, instead of like, Swasti crap! Because it sounded like swastika, right? Well, no, it, it wasn't because of that, but now... Yes, I'm thinking well, about that's, that. Well, that's what you were thinking about at the time. Initially, it's gone, it's when like, we it first... Like I'm just I'm saying swastika Hello, publicly. swastika! <laughs> so, what is well, it? Swastika to you? So, what's crap? Swastika? So, what's the crap? Because we are men, and if we were yeah. females, it would be... So, what's the car? Car or so crap? Swastika. Mm -hmm. Um, there was a woman in the hallway oh, of our hotel. That it's just the worst smell. <laughs> it's it. Oh my oh, god. god. <laughs> oh no. Um, oh! <laughs> I'm not getting it yet. Um, okay. Oh my god! <laughs> it's your own fart. It's your own brew. <laughs> you poisoned yourself. You poisoned the well. So you guys remember god. that greeter at the hotel? It smells like, like an entire environment. I'm just sorry. Constantly greet. You know that woman in the hallway outside the restaurant? Every time you walk past her, she would say Tomatica. hello. Tomatica! Like, I continuously. I walked past her like three or four times going from the ho restaurant back to the hotel room. And every time she greeted me like it was a brand new experience. The like, other thing, yes, right. yes, hello. The other thing I struggle with when they greet and all do any sort of politeness is they do the hand clasping yeah. Yeah, prayer yeah. gesture. Well, but yeah. I usually got something in my hand and I'm fumbling to try and... Every oh, time I had, a, I had shit. the camera in one hand and like my phone in another. I was like, oh, I just do it. I'm together. Do it okay, well. cool. Just do a one-handed one. <laughs> and they bow and it's very polite. It's nice, to be honest. I, I thought, like. yeah, everyone we met were really, was really nice. Um, yeah. Very polite people. Um, yeah, it was... Drains smelled like very shit, didn't they? Uh, Drains smelled like shit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Turns out when you base most of your dishes off of fish sauce, Shit stinks! Also, when they're constantly cooked in 30 degree heat. <laughs> holy, wow! Holy fucking shit. There was There's no rain to suppress that smell. Fucking smells in Thailand. Oh. They need an aqueduct. God! Just to get it out. It was so bad, the smells, man. Jesus. Yeah, but just yeah, like I mean, we were going through a night market. To get used to. So when you go through a night market, you're like, oh, scented candles. Oh my god, a drain! <laughs> oh! There's a train right next to it. Next to the place of Pussy Palace. And then oh, yeah, Ping Pussy Pong. Palace, nice. Ping Pong Palace. That was an actual place. We were not just saying I thought words. It was so, I thought it was so saddening that that's like the main kind of export that people know. Yeah. Oh, I'm getting that fart now. <laughs> oh, I'm still, god. I'm still Doesn't clear it just it. conjure like an inside of a cave? <clears throat> oh, it's rank. Like a really salty cave. Fuck me. With lots of... Stanky seaweed. Oh, oh no! <laughs> I don't want that. I oh, why do I smell your dirty fart? It's like when you got a sore throat and you keep swallowing regardless. <laughs> no. I'm like keep smelling. Just to, is it still there? Where, yet? where you're thinking I shouldn't swallow, but now I'm. <laughs> you're still taking it in and taking an extra whiff. Oh, through your nose, Christ. Hell. Yeah, one Ugh. one downside of um, kind of mentioning Jesus. that you're in Thailand is that most people just say random shit like, "Oh, oh you're gonna no. just go there to see lady boys," or "Oh, he's trying to get a sex change." It's like so or fucking if the shallow and to go fickle, by. and it sounds like that's all we're here for. Just boring. That that's all that people can think of. There were a lot Thailand. of ping pong shows. To be fair, though, all, that's all, all we got offered when we were in um, the marketplace area. But ping pong show. That's the, um, ping pong show. It's only because that's what it's become for the for UK tourists. That's a it. fucking bunch of chavs going over there watching ping pong Sleeveless. shows. Sleeveless. And they think that that's what people them. want. That's, they think that's what the... We saw a lot of English guys with shaved heads, sleeveless t-shirts, in groups, drinking beer. A lot. Seems to be the thing. Yeah, I mean, well, there's, there's quite a party, party element. What well, was when I shaved time, my head and got sleeveless when I really felt like part of it, you know? Right, right, I'm ready to go. Let's do this. Let's go to Pussy Palace. Let's get <laughs> Take me to Pussy Palace. I want a ping pong. I want to see some Alice. jaded performances by people that are crying on the inside. No, they're fine. <laughs> are they okay? Were they all right? Probably. Well, they wouldn't do it if they didn't enjoy it. Mm. They are very skilled. They're professionals, drunk. I mean, you know. I mean, you did a better job with it. Well, thank you. But I, I feel like I, I had you more been propulsion. For years, right? I had You've loads of propulsion. I feel like you were you had an advantage, advantage really. Some some with with ping people pongs. like they they finish with the canary out of the you know out of the <laughs> the thing. Shot finished with a whole macaw parrot. Yeah. This is like, a big. Sorry, they finished with what? What? They finished with what? A canary. Who finishes with a canary? What do you mean? The ping, the ping pong, pong show. girls. They they put what? live canary and then it flies yeah. out. Yeah. Oh, I thought you were joking when you said that originally. No, that's real. When you first told me about that, that's not actually part of the show, is it? Yeah. Yeah. They put a live canary in there. Yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah. I imagine they. That's cut the, horrible. I imagine they cut the claws. Yeah. 
the yeah. fuck? <laughs> that's fucking. Good shot did a full size parrot. That's animal start cruelty. Today. That's brutal. Oh, yeah. so it's catfishing, Ross. Yeah, you dragged to a in degree, large yeah. fish. It shat but all I've, over you. It did shit all over me. And for good reason. I feel like I would shit myself if someone dragged me out of where, my habitat and then <laughs> chucked me back in moments later for me to just be upset and just sh taking a picture of. <laughs> there it is. Um, I am concerned that people, there will be a, a chunk of our audience getting very annoyed that Nobody we're Nobody cares dragging. about fish. But that's the thing, I don't know if, the, do they? No, they don't. This is the thing, this is the irony of it all. If yeah. those were like, yeah, other animals that people care more about, then sure. But like the elephants, because we saw some elephants there yeah. that looked kind of in, in very questionable Fishing those was fucking tough. Fishing those was one of the biggest <laughs> challenges. Yeah. And uh, honestly, harpooning it. When it was in the water, oh man. Getting in the net. Oh. <laughs> it was really Oh hard. no, I picked a baggy. <laughs> Fuck. What's that? That's the sound of a baggy. I'll still win. Of course. Crass. Um, yeah, no, the elephants weren't in a great condition. We well, did not, not after we, we, we didn't, fucking netted them. No. We not refused after we finished with them, Jesus. To ride the elephants, they were getting yeah, beaten. But, you know, elephant skull goes well in my lounge, guys, so. I can't believe you fit yeah. that in your luggage. I like yeah. elephant tail soup. Yeah. Nice. Also, I've got a great new piano. There you go. Oh, have you really? You managed to... <laughs> you're the whole piano from, from the one elephant. From the one elephant, yeah. Well, that's well, no, strings I, and all. It had an adolescent child as well. Oh, oh yeah. Brilliant. Let's get the brilliant. ebony it's fine. and ivory. They can survive without tusks. Um, no, but in reality, we did see some fairly um, questionable... Um, Questionably treated. Yeah. Got taken there by a uh, taxi driver who also took us to some other... Uh, the taxi driver's paid off. Uh, yeah. I'm quite happy to say that that's blatantly what happened. The, Seems to be the case agreement. with most taxi drivers. They like they'll take you to a place where they've been paid off. Yeah. So if you go there, um, just be cautious of. They're weather. always up pricing everything. We got take. We went on a, a boat ride, and the taxi guy took us to some promotional place where they charged us one thousand baht more. Well, they tried to. Tried to, but and you know, if we it. had not been clued up on the whole situation we would have taken that <laughs> yeah. instead we bloody got a guy for 60 quid for the entire day <laughs> a man sub two two men two, two men. men and a boat and a boat for the entire day you live like a king in thailand you can you really can but so this is what it feels unless like you want fun. branded products which are exactly <laughs> oh. the same price as they are people back. are cheap in thailand <laughs> yeah well people and services <laughs> Services are cheap because sometimes it's it's weird how um, the ta taxis were so different in prices. Yeah, they were just, each one. Occasionally, it'd be like two hundred baht, well. like or then five hundred. Then it's like, oh fuck, seven hundred baht. And it's like what? Because some of them were just like trying to rip us off. Yeah, I know. But otherwise, it was a good trip. I oh thought, man, I thought there's a lot of history in uh, Bangkok. Well, me and I've got a lot of history You've in got Bangkok. Left there. a lot of stuff behind. Yeah, especially after a lot of baggage time. in Bangkok. Um, no, I liked all the fucking temples, the ang angles, the watts, Angkor. The, the, oh yeah, well, the so watts. What? Yeah. Angle watts is the Anchor. biggest one. In like, there. Massive yeah. Buddhas, Cambodia, yeah. like inside yeah. that building. Oh my god. Oh, the big fucking Buddhas. Oh. I love. No, but that was that was apparently a small one, but it fucking I filled the building. It was out amazing. of all the religions, I I have the most respect for Buddhism. Yeah, it's just a cool. Religion. What's the scale? What's the rest of the scale? Yeah, like? What's the re Do you have like? Um, it's like top five. A specific measure for uh, what order. you consider as bad as a religion. Can you list off your worst religion, yeah, Trot, least, for everyone to hear? Least to most favourite. Just um, <laughs> <laughs> This is going to cause some... Uh, <laughs> Just well, tell us what... Yeah, and then give us You're five picking a favourite. That means you got to have a least favourite, Trot. Oh, That's yeah, how these things least favourite, Trot? Waiting least in there favorite? with Buddhism And then favorite. make a comment about the people that believe in that religion. Yeah. Go for it. Even get All secular right. with it if you like. So choose like Honestly. Catholicism versus, yeah, you yeah. know... Church go for more modern ones, yeah. Go for more modern ones, ones that have been made up maybe by Catholics, a fictional... right? Oh, here we go. Least favorite. Why? Why? It's just. I didn't think you would actually start listing them off. So <laughs> what, what, what? Yeah. No, I just thought I'd go balls deep with it. Balls deep. All right, mainstream Sunni Shiite. You got to fuck one, marry one, kill one. <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> what? Mainstream Sunni Shiite. I don't know what you're saying. Sunni. Is it Sunni? Sunni and Shiite. Shiite. Shite. It's different parts of that Islam trot. Yeah, I'm not clued up on that. Not part, so it's not, it's not like in my spectrum. Sort of. It's not in your spectrum. So he likes Buddhism, <clears throat> it's his favourite. Uh, I can only start putting them on the scale when I have a reasonable amount of knowledge about them. Okay, what are the ones who are on the scale at the moment then? Christianity's pretty far down. Yeah. Um, so what's in between that and uh, Buddhism? Scientology. Scientology's Scientology. in the middle. 
Wow, I mean, wow, left field. Come side, come like, Easy come, easy go. Yeah. Theta. Yeah. Audits. I'm up for that. <clears throat> You're an operating theta. I, I want to be one day. Well, you can only Listen, hope. L. Ron Hubbard is a great businessman. And Whoa. And he created a fantastic religion. Created? Um, well, or yeah. discovered. He's a sci-fi writer, guys. He discovered Ross. He literally a sci-fi writer. He made it up. He wrote that. No, he discovered it. He wrote it the came book to him it. in a dream. No, he did a great job of writing Vision. it. And now, look at this. He's Premonition. Great. He's going to live on forever in all of their... Oh, you could say that about minds. a lot of religions, Ross. Yeah, but he wrote it recently. So, so well, recent. let's start our own one. We can pin it. Right, we're starting our own religion, guys. Um, next time you hear of trials, we'll be... We'll tell you all about Fully it. fledged with our own religion. You'll, you'll all want to join. Yeah. See you later. See, see you next time. Bye.